Trees contribute immensely to the environment by providing oxygen for breathing, improving air quality and land beautification. Since the commencement of the tree planting in Lagos, the practice has improved the quality of life. This year, 2024 tree planting was not an exception for Agbado Kyodo Local Council Development Area. In the presence of Agbado Kyodo Council Management, community leaders, traditional rulers, political leaders, members of the legislative arms. Speaking at the event, the executive chairman of Agbado Kyodo LCDA, David Famuywa, said one of the key agenda of his administration is a clean and green environment. He discouraged indiscriminate cutting of trees and admonished the residents to imbibe the habit of planting trees. The theme of this year's tree planting exercise is not all our future. Underscore the fact that everybody, irrespective of your political, religious, and social belief, need to have a change in attitude to protect our environment because it is our land and our future. Let me stay here on a good record that there is the urgent need for everyone that's there in the Lagos to focus on street planting in order to contribute efforts at migrants, climate change and creating a sustainable environment. The head of Agbado Kyodo Environmental Department gave insight on the importance of trees within our society and also appreciated the support of legal citizens towards the green project geared towards sustainable environment. The relationship between man and nature is brought together. And even in planting trees, it maintains our environment. Like presently now, we have flood problem in Lagos State. Planting trees is one of the ways to mitigate against flood in Lagos State. And I'm very sure that if we are able to plant trees in all our environment, greening our environment at all times, we are going to grow healthy and our future will be very sure to have an healthy environment at all times. The vice chairman of the LCDA, who also doubled as the supervisor for environment, Agbado Okeodo LCDA, also advised the resident to imbibe the tree planting culture so as to enjoy the benefits and to desist from indiscriminate cutting of trees. On our streets, we had a dogo yarrow from, the, from one end of the street to the end of the street. And you know from Lagos Street, um, Benin Street, all the streets in Zaria had these trees. And then the children can go around playing under the trees. It was really beautiful. Please ensure that you nurture these trees, especially the ones that are along uh, Ikola Road down to Obasanjo Bridge. The one at um, Alagbadu that is a close nearby to, I can still see some of these trees. So I'm appealing to each and every one of us to ensure that these trees are well maintained for the sake of all of us uh, and our environment. The motor boys, they don't care. Not only the motor people, including the individuals, but the importance of it, we have to let them know by ensuring that anyone that destroys any of them, we make him or her also to pay. So the common thing in Nigeria these days, anything is of government, people don't really after it much. So I want to encourage the chairman, and I want to appreciate him also for doing this. If not, other person have not been doing this under local government, and nothing happened to them. But in our own local government here, in Agado State, we can't be trying. So, for that, it cannot be This initiative will continue to ensure a much cleaner and healthier environment. We have lost touch with our nature, and that's why we're in this problem today. That's why food is expensive, everybody is uh, screaming about uh, the high cost of living. It is because we have lost it. We have moved away from what we used to do. In the past, our parents, you know, were farmers and food was surplus. But these days, everybody wants to hold the pain. Nobody wants to go to the farm. And that's why we are having issues today. Anywhere we planted the tree, apart from people planted the tree, 
every home, every home should plant free so that they can share their, their home and give them the oxygen and protect our environment. So whoever caught the tree without approval will be penalized. Oh,